the best UFO video hidden in plain sight. A man from Michigan saw a very strange object up in the sky near his home. When he ran out to his vehicle to get a closer look at it, the UFO started moving towards him and he got this on video. Check this out. There's like a green laser light coming out of the UFO onto the ground. That is so weird. Notice how you don't hear anything. Oh, it's scanning that light on his car. It's just gone. You don't hear anything. Oh, it's scanning that light on his car. This is Psalms chapter 68. Verse 17, the chariots of the Most High are 20,000, even thousands of angels. The Lord is among them, as in Sinai, in the holy place. Call Halal, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakah, Kodash, that's given all praise to the Most High in the name of his only begotten son. My name is Ibar from the prophets in Babylon camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And I want to give double honors to the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone who taught us his truth and truth and sincerity, peace and salutations to the hopeful like scattered abroad. In this video, I want to touch on this vehicle that you saw in this video, okay, which is a chariot, what they call in this, today's world, UFOs. Now they call them UAP, uh, UAPs. Some call them flying saucers. The truth of the matter is these are the, um, the, you know the vessels of, of the angelic beings of real true angelic beings okay the 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 god of israel which are the so-called negroes hispanics native indians his angels move and travel in these vessels okay and what you saw coming from the vessel was you know it's a it was it's called a tractor beam all right and you know you you you, you hear stories of you know, did, did different accounts where this tractor beam will come down and it'll beam something up. You know, it'll, it'll take something up with it. You know, that's why they say beam me up Scotty, which means beam me up Blackie. All right. The Scots were um, originally Israelites, you know, so it's me, me, beam, beam me up Blackie, which the angels are what you would call melanated beings. OK, they're melanated beings. They're in the little white babies with uh, butt naked white, white babies with wings and bow and arrows. No, the holy angels move in these, you know, ships, man. And, the, and in these ships, they're doing miraculous things in the earth. And really, they're going to come back with our Lord to destroy this earth. All right. So let's bring this back. Psalm 68, verse 17. The chariots of the Most High, Yahweh Bahashim Yahushai, are 20,000, even thousands of angels, which means millions. Okay. And these um, angels are the eyes of the Most High. So they fly around in these uh, ships, you know, watching... You know over the whole world you know and they got accounts of these ships flying you know super fast and then stopping you know on a dime they got footage of these ships flying in the air and then you know going underwater and then coming back up in the air you know which esau the white man who's in power today he cannot replicate this technology with his uh i mean that he cannot rep he cannot replicate this uh power in these ships with his technology man okay he cannot do that all right, these um, ships go 
past mock speed or right, i saw a video i did a video of it, uh, uh, last week of a chariot that zoomed off going like 2800 thousand miles per hour okay that, that and that's what they clocked it at but it says the lord is among them so the lord you know is with the angels man okay our, our, our lord operates through the holy angels and when he comes back he's going to make his second coming with these ships okay as in sinai in the holy place okay so and that's the thing too man you know the lord is going to deliver us back to our holy place via these vessels via these ships it says Isaiah chapter 66 verse 15 for behold Yahweh will come with fire and with his chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire okay Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai is going to send his son okay well Yahweh is going to send his son with fire okay and with his chariots like a whirlwind these chariots right here okay a whirlwind is like a, 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 a tornado I remember I saw a video one time. It was like three tornadoes, and in the midst of the tornadoes, they showed you these ships, you know, inside those tornadoes, you know, pretty much causing those to 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 tornadoes, man. Okay, this is the curse that go before the whole earth. I noticed it said, "And the Lord, you know, to like you, behold, the Lord will come with fire, which those thermonuclear missiles, but ultimately these ships, you know, have something called uh, um." That they, they, they shoot laser beams, you know, concentrated fire that can, you know, devour you and turn you into dust, man. Okay. So we in the time where we about to see more of these vehicles. We about to see, um, uh, uh, you, you, you know, all kinds of, you know, um, uh, miraculous things in the earth. You see this vehicle, it's just, a, it's just light. It's just light. And you will see it if it's very high in the sky. It'll look like a star, but it'll, it'll be moving, you know, it'll be moving, you know, at a certain pace or move, move, movements sporadically, you know, through, through, through the sky. These are these are the vessels, the holy, the holy, the holy angels, man. All right. And the Lord's going to make it uh, known in, in this end time, you know. Also, this is the the, 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 the salvation. This is going to be our salvation. Let me grab that. I mean, it's too long. All right. This is going to be our salvation, man. So those of us that believe and that serving Yahweh Bosh, you know, Shai, and truth and sincerity, the whole world is about to find out who the true man of the Lord is, man. The whole Lord is about to find out who the Lord is really dealing with. And when that time comes where that impending doom, that thermal nuclear destruction, Russia, Iran, China, North Korea sending missiles over here, we, you will want to be saved. That's what it means to be saved. What it means to be saved is it means to be saved from thermal nuclear destruction, which is going to be hell on earth. Okay, that's the real like a fire which will be America and go off the flames after it's hit with over 200 thermonuclear missiles. It's like a 200 million thermonuclear missiles. All right. Which that's what these nations are preparing, preparing for now. You got Russia arming these other nations with uh, nuclear missiles. Hey, like it's candy, man. They passed out missiles like it's candy. All right. And at one point in time, America was had made the whole world fear from what it did to Hima, Hiroshima, and Nagasaki. And now this whole time, Russia has been arming up on their nuclear arsenal, and they've been giving it to these other nations that have been robbed and spoiled of America. So they're going to send shoot missiles over here. That's World War Three. World War Three will be fought with you know, f uh, you know, fuel. I mean, um, um, burning fire, man. Okay. And in that, you want to be delivered. Okay, you 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 gonna want the Lord to come and deliver you, and 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 then that deliverance. It's going to come by um, one of these vessels, man. You saw how it was flying away and how it was moving when it was, as it was flying away. Let me see if I can grab it real quick. Look at this thing. Look how it's just, you know, it's like, <laughs> like it's crazy, man. But that, but that, but that's the power that we serve, man. You know, and for the past like, I don't know, man. The past like three or four weeks, man, we've been at camp and we've been seeing these um chariots flying over it's matter just fact, gone last week so like yeah matter of fact last week at camp it was uh it was, we, we had some, some some guys up you know um oh it's scanning that light getting edified pretty much this car so like, let me see if I find it. we had some guys come up and they was getting edified and then as they was getting edified you know i uh the spirit told me which i'm gonna do a video on this but the spirit told me to go into the chariots and these are some new guys, so I was like, oh, I don't know, I don't know. My spirit's kind of like, I don't know. 
but the spirit told me to go into the chariots. So I started going into the chariots, and then right as I started going into it, a guy walked by with a UFO on his shirt, okay, with a tractor beam, okay, with that light coming down and beating beaming uh, something up, all right. And um, then after that, shortly after that, we started seeing we actually, you know, one of the birds looked up and we actually saw one in the sky, okay. And I'm gonna see if I can find that clip, but I gotta search. There's a couple clips I want to get. So let's go here. It says, Wisdom of Solomon. Then shall the righteous man stand in great boldness. Wisdom of Solomon chapter 5, verse 1. Then shall the righteous man stand in great boldness before the face of such have afflicted him and made no account of his labors. And this, this happened to us. Okay. In, in, including captivity. Okay. It says, um, we had to work, but also us doing this work for Yahweh Bashan al Shai. People think we're crazy. They think, they, they think we're doing this for, 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 for nothing. They have no idea. It says, when they see it, when they see what, when they see these men getting delivered, these women and the children get, 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 getting delivered, okay, you know, you know, 2.5 2 minutes before, um, you know, missiles, you know, hit ground zero. It says, when they see it, they shall be troubled with terrible fear. Imagine these people that you don't despise and talk shit about and, you know, look down upon are now getting delivered and you're and, 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 and you're not. That's going to be a scary thought because you're going to want to ask some people, can, can you take me with you? But you know that you didn't treat them wrong and you know that you ain't going with them. It says when they see it, they shall be troubled with terrible fear and shall be amazed at the strangeness of his salvation. So far beyond all that they look for, man. These people, they are not prepared for the 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 the, 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 the salvation, you know, the, the 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 power that's about to reveal be revealed in this earth for the most high people, man. For God's true people, man. It says, when they see it, they shall be troubled with terrible fear, and shall not and shall be amazed at the strangeness of his salvation. It's gonna be strange to see a so-called black man, a so-called Mexican, a so-called uh, uh, Puerto Rican man get beamed up into one of these ships right before missiles hit okay you thinking oh we're all gonna die anyways especially these niggers especially these yeah no nope just you okay just you it says um it says so far beyond all that they look for because they ain't thinking about this people these people trying to you know uh uh uh, uh you know they're thinking this salvation gonna come by trump they're thinking, they're thinking that, that Trump is a savior. They, they, they're thinking that, you know, a, a, a Biden going to pull the shit together. They're expecting the next president. They're thinking they're they, they, they going to win the lottery. They, 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 they're hoping that, you know, world, world peace come. But our salvation is going to come through Yehovah Bashim Yosh Shai in a magnificent, you know, way. Just like when we got delivered out of, you know, e uh, Egypt, that first exodus. We're now we're about to come into the second exodus. And the first exodus, people still talk about it to this day. They, they, they still making movies about it to this day, you know. The, when we got when, when we fled out of Egypt and the Lord, you know, um, pretty much, um, he he made a path in the sea, you know, for the Israelites to pass through, and deliver them. But then he uh, he had it where when, when Pharaoh and his soldiers tried to go through, they got swallowed up in that sea. You see, so the Lord delivered Israel in that in that in that miraculous way in form and fashion. But this next the second Exodus is going to be an even greater. You know, way in form and fashion through these ships. Okay, it says they repenting and groaning for anguish of spirit. By the way, when we got delivered out, 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 out of um, Egypt, the Lord God, um, um, you know, He had guided us in the wilderness, you know, through a cloud by day and a pillar of fire by night, which was a chariot, a UFO, as they would call it in, in, in this world. It says they repenting and groaning for anguish of spirit. They shall say within themselves, This was He whom we had sometimes in derision and a proverb of reproach because they're going to be feeling like shit it says we fools accounting his life madness they think we crazy conspiracy theorists wasting our time accounting his life madness and his end to be without honor they thought we was going to be the ones that was going to be destroyed and we was the crazy ones and oh they say not my jesus not my you know you know well guess what see if your lord save you in that day see if jesus come and save you man okay the, 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 the lord's true name is yahweh shai and without that name you know, scripture says the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous runneth into it and is safe. So imagine a time coming when you in trouble. You know, when that fire coming and you got to call upon the name of the Lord. You calling upon everybody gonna be calling upon their God, and you call upon Yahweh Bashim Yah Shai, and then one of these you know sh ships zing zoot by, you know zing by and stop over you and beam you up and your family, man. 
but leave everybody else around you there that was calling upon Jesus, that was calling upon Allah, that was calling upon, you know, Allah Akbar, you know, <laughs> and, they, and they get left there, you know, for, for the real bombs. It says, um, how is he numbered among the children of God and his lot among the saints, which are the Israelites, man? Okay, so I'm in off with this right here. Because not only is, is our salvation going to be great, um, not only is our salvation going, 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 going to be great, but also the king that we're about to inherit. Okay, if this is the way our salvation is going to be, you know, and how miraculous and marvelous our salvation is going to be, imagine when we inherit this kingdom. Okay, we're going to have chariots constantly, you know, uh, hovering over our do do domains. We're going to be, you know, uh, wealthy. Okay, not rich. I'm talking about wealthy, you know, set. You know, and we're gonna have slaves, man. You know, and 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 that, that's gonna be the end of this kingdom, and the new world, and the new world to come. This is Esau's kingdom. Jacob's kingdom is about to be fashioned, and the Lord said, "In this kingdom, okay, we we have no idea about how glory, how, how how beautiful it's gonna be. We have no idea how beautiful it is inside these ships. And when we meet our Lord, Lord willing, in the air, the Scripture says they shall meet thee in the air. Okay. It's in Second Corinthians chapter two, verse nine. It says, "But as it is written." But as it is written, I have not seen nor ear heard, neither have entered into the heart of man the things which the Most High have prepared for them that love him. Okay, so no eye have seen nor ear have heard the things that the Most High have prepared for, for, for those that love him, man. Okay, you can't even imagine, you can't even put, put in your mind, even if you try to imagine it, it's more, it, it, it is way more excellent than you can ever imagine. What the Lord has set up for those that love him the Lord, For those that are serving him those, those that are doing his will for his servants Okay So there you go man Our praise is edifying to the Lord for the next Shalom Kwame Shirala Abad Baba Light on his car And then it's just gone. It just disappears and it's gone. That power is coming, man. It just disappeared and then it was gone. Okay? So that's how fast these ships move. They can teleport. You know? Whatever. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.